everybody. It is a Friday, June 18th, 2021. We're going to be doing a card of the day, a focus of intention for the next 24 to 48 hours as directed by spirit universe or whatever higher power you call upon. This is coming from the sacred symbols Oracle deck by Marcella Kroll. With that being said, this is not a reading. A reading is an intimate discussion between you and a spiritual advisor of your choice, hopefully led by your intuition. As I always say, your intuition is your superpower. Everyone's born intuitive. Not everyone listens to their intuition as you can see the state of the world. Now, a few announcements. The Almighty Pineapple is trademarked, copyrighted, and registered with the United States government and several different classifications. Any duplication of my content without my permission is subject to legal recourse as guided by my lawyer and her legal team. Tomorrow, Saturday, June 19th at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time is the community reading. It is $20 per person. It is a place where you can ask any question that you would like and build community with people of like mind and like spirit what i've noticed is that so many people who join the zoom community reading start linking up on their facebook on their twitter and are even members of the i am the altar membership page those who are part of i am the altar membership private facebook group you automatically get included into all the community rituals every month into the community reading every month Plus, you get a weekly reading for all members, the forecast, the astrology for the week. It's a reading. It's not like a card of the day. So that's the main difference. If you're interested, go to the website, thealmightypineapple.com and search on the membership page if you're interested or go to in-person digital session services for the community reading and the new moon. Is it new moon? Let me check. Sorry, I get them confused. The full moon in Capricorn community ritual is now up and available for purchase next week as well. That will be June 24th, 2021 at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. At this time, I'm offering 30 minute mini readings for the month of July. Effective July 1st, 2021, the rates will be going up for all services. So get in now before July 1st, 2021 as well. We have lots of changes. For those of you who've donated to Spike's Medical Care, which is one of my special needs dogs, again, that information's on the donation page as well. One of my you know, special needs bully breeds. Thank you so much. Thank you for the prayers. Thank you for the Reiki. Thank you for the energy. Thank you for the donation. You don't have to do it, but you did. So I appreciate it. Let's get to the card of the day. The card of the day is called Shift. One of my favorite cards because it is the time for you to start navigating in a new pathway because what you have been doing and what you started to do, you've gotten distracted or you've gotten stuck in those ways, stuck in those behaviors, stuck in those patterns, stuck in that mind frame, stuck in that toxic environment, stuck in that career, stuck in that relationship. It is time to shift. That's without even getting into the guidebook. Spirit's moving today. So let's see. The guidebook says miracles, divine intervention, the end of stagnation, and divine inspiration is here now. Drawing this card signifies an aha moment or sudden change in any situation that was stuck or blocked. A welcome change or answer you have been seeking is here now. Meditate on this symbol when you're feeling stuck, unsure which way to go, or having a block creatively. Symbol is called the breakthrough. Dagaz, D-A-G-A-Z, is a Norse rune. It is the last rune of the Futhark, which is the oldest form of runic alphabets and literally means day. The rune is a symbol of fulfillment and achievement, the rebirth of the light in one's life. It is the rune of awakening, of the dawn, and of the day rise, which coincides with the full moon in Capricorn. The areas of intention for that is, because I have it right here. It's going to be a good one. 
The areas of intention for next week's full moon in Capricorn community ritual is success, ambition, good fortune, ascension, generosity, honesty, and abundance. And it's time to shift, it's time to grow, and it's time to evolve. If you're not ready for that change, that's okay too. You don't have to be ready to be a part of this full moon and Capricorn community ritual. But spirit, universe, whatever higher power you call upon is telling you it's time to shift. Stop expecting a change while doing the same shit. I hope I helped. I hope I put some things in perspective. I hope I made you feel better. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing to my channel. Thank you for sharing this video with someone who you feel is going to resonate with. Thank you for being here with me. You don't have to choose me, but you're here. And thank you for following your intuition when working with any spiritual advisor, even if that means you do not work with me. Your intuition will guide you to who, what, when, where, and how to work with those spiritual advisors and practitioners. Thank you for fucking with me and I'll see y'all later.